hello friends so in this video i will teach you how to do some netting without using paper or pen or basically this video i make so that uh, you can do some netting quickly in most cases uh, what uh, in some netting there is a question arises that we need to take out the ip range that is uh, the first ip and the last ip of a segment for troubleshooting etc we need it uh, on daily basis so in this video i will uh, tell you the shortcut so that uh, you you will also learn it and uh, apply it first thing i want to tell you that uh, one that you have to learn this table 19 128 192 224 240 248 252 254 255 basically uh, these are the subnet marks which can be uh, used with the ip address secondly as uh, we know that ipv4 is 8 byte so in each byte we have 8 bit so according to it 8 byte equal to 32 bit example like this uh, ip is 192.168.1.23 now this is called one octet this 192 168 is second octet this one is third octet and 23 is fourth octet each octet is of 8 bit because if we combine these four octet the bytes are equal to 8 bytes and each octet is of 8 bit this table is based on the number of ones in a subnet mask so suppose there is one ip that is 192.168.1.23 and slash 28 one thing i want to clear is that i forgot to tell you is uh, that we have uh, subnet marks of two types that is simple uh, subnet marks that is uh, 255 255 255.240 and second is slash notation which is also called as cidr like 28 29 30 this uh, slash notation is uh, end on /32 because uh, each bit represent this slash notation like slash 1 slash 2 slash 3 slash 4 and it will go to slash /32 because we have total of 32 bit that's why it will go till slash /32 now suppose uh, i have a ip 192.168.1.23/28 now it is asked that in which uh, subnet this ip reside or uh, the question is that uh, what is the range in which this ip reside or what is a first ip or second ip what we will do is that uh, if we get uh, suppose if we get a question in which we get a subnet mark simple subnet marks that is 255 255 255 then we have to con uh, convert it into a slash notation because this trick is only applied to a slash notation so let's begin like this is slash 28 what what will we do is we will minus this 28 from 32 that is equal to 4 we will minus this uh, slash notation from 32 because the last bit of this octet is 32 like for this octet it is 8 for this octet it is 8 for this octet it is 16 for this octet it is 24 for this octet it is 32 this is 28 so what is uh, happening is uh, we have 8 bit in this plus 8 bit in this plus 8 bit in this plus and 
what is the addition of this 8 plus 8 16 plus 8 24 and this is 28 which is plus 4 so our subnet will work on this 23 means our subnetting uh, will be in this last octet that is 4 so we minus this from 32 and it is equal to 4 and second what we will we'll do is we will do 2 is to raise to the power 4 that is 2 into 2 into 2 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 that is equal to 2 16 now what will we do we will uh, check the table of 16 like 16 into 0 equal to 0 16 into 1 equal to 16 16 into 2 equal to 32 we will check that uh, this 23 will will should be between which table like 6 like 16 32 after finding it we will find that it is between 16 and 32 so this is my answer so the starting IP is 192.168.1.16 16 my end IP will be 192.168.1.32 but this 1.32 is the last IP which is also known as broadcast IP So we cannot use this broadcast IP in our PCs or router. So what is a usable IP range is 32 minus 1 that is 192.168.1.31. So my IP range usable IP range will be from 16 to 31 and my broadcast IP for this segment is dot 32 basically what uh, what is happening here that uh, there are different uh, segments for this IP address what is different segment like uh, different subnet for this IP is like because we have taken out is uh, 16 so the different uh, subnets for this IP is from 0 to 16 from 16 to 32 from 32 to 48 and so on so what is my IP range is from 0 to 16 second IP range is from 16 to 32 32 to 48 and so on so what is uh, happening here is that basically these are the different subnets in which it, this IP is divided by using slash 28 slash notation basically this is a shortcut method method to find the starting IP and the end IP and the broadcast IP for any segment hope this video is useful to us please subscribe comment or leave the feedback in the comment session and also like this video thank you for watching this video